All right, this is my dance, Fire with a Y, that's F-Y-R-E. The original song is Fire and Gold by Morgan Page, featuring a bunch of other people, but that's how you can find it. It's a 32 count, four wall, improver level line dance. This dance took first place in Hotlanta in 2019. You can do it to pretty much any hip hop song. If you do, you may need to add restarts to make it fit the music perfectly, but you can do that as you see fit. But by itself, it's a 32 count line dance, and it can go to pretty much anything. Your first set of eight is gonna be cross, touch, cross, touch, back, touch, back, touch. With counts, that's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Second set of eight, we're gonna start with a coaster step, which is back together forward. You're gonna step with a half pivot, step, Pivot, taking the weight on the right. You're gonna do a side rock recover with a quarter turn. Side rock, recover, behind side cross. Behind side cross. So with the counts, you came out of your point. That's one and two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. So your third set of eight is a series of turning hip bumps. But I'm gonna show it first without the hip bumps, and then we'll add the hip bumps in after. So we ended the second set of eight on the nine o'clock wall, but we're technically kind of angled a little bit towards the diagonal. So for the third set of eight, we're actually going to move towards those diagonals, the 1030 wall, if you will. So without the hip bumps, we're gonna step, hold, taking the weight in the front foot. We're gonna do a half turn pivot, taking the weight on the left foot. Step, hold, half turn pivot hold that's without the hip bumps if you add the hip bumps in from your rock recover behind side cross step hip bump turn hip bump step hip bump turn hip bump all at the diagonal walls with the counts rock recover behind side cross that's where we started with the counts five six seven eight we got one and two three and four five and six seven and eight. Final set of eight. We're going to do a eight turn jazz box, cross, back, out, step, which will square us back up from the diagonal to the main 12 o'clock wall. That's one, two, three, four. We're going to step and do a half pivot. And then we're gonna do a three quarter paddle turn, paddle, paddle to finish the dance, taking us to the nine o'clock wall. That paddle will lead directly into the cross touches that start the dance over. So from our hip bumps, Reed's got a jazz box. One, two, three, four. Step, half pivot, taking the weight on the front foot, and then you're going to do two paddle turns to go three quarters. Paddle, paddle. You're using your right foot to propel your body around. So. Paddle, paddle, cross, touch, cross, touch, is how the dance starts. So the last set of eight with counts, one more time. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four. So the whole dance, all the way through from the top. Cross, point, cross, point, back, point, back, point. Coach their step, step, half pivot, Side rock recover, behind side cross. Step, hip, bump, step, hip, bump, step, hip, bump, step, hip, bump. Jazz, box, step, step. Half, pivot, three, quarter, paddle. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One and two, three, four, five, six, seven and eight. One and two, three and four, five and six, Seven and eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four. Now you do have one styling option. During that first set of eight, with your cross, touch, cross, touch, for the first two, you could do instead kick, cross, touch, kick, cross, touch. You're kicking at a diagonal, crossing, and touching to the side. Now this isn't something you want to do on every wall, but during certain choruses it'll fit really nicely. You can kind of feel it out for yourself when you like it. 
foot. It would be kick, cross, touch, kick, cross, touch, back, touch, back, touch. You used to hold me close at night, but now you're on the other side.